um, the differentiation has gone as far as action is concerned, as far as mitigation action is concerned, as far as review is concerned. So there is no differentiation now in the review. Uh, there is all part, India will also have an MRV on them. They will all party, so that is universal. Both the action and the review is universal. The only place where we have maintained differentiation is in finance. So in that sense, we can still argue that a differentiation contains because the developed countries are required to give money to developing countries for their actions. So in that sense, a differentiation between the obligation of developed versus developing has been maintained on finance. But the worrying part of it is two or three things. One, the most worrying part of it is that there will be now a ratcheting up of ambition, but the, there has been no operationalization of equity by including the carbon budget. By putting in, if you had said that the that countries would have to increase their ambition based on the fair share of the carbon budget, which is what Mr. Modi had said when he came, and it was there in the earlier draft, the fact that that has gone does create problems for the future. So you can argue that you have not lost everything, that the battle will now move to the next round, because there are two places where we have gained, which I do think is important. One, we have said that the agreement will be based on equity and CBDR and on the principles of the convention, so that is clear. It also says, and that I am told is uh, contentious still, it has one phrase uh, that says that the actions of developing countries, developed countries will be targets, whereas developing countries yeah, will have to take on actions, yeah, efforts. Huh. Now there is a difference there, for they have that. one line that they have maintained, but in every other way there is no differentiation maintained. And there is now a timeline. In 2018, there will be a special report of IPCC to talk about what will be the actions required to keep the country, uh, the world under 1.5. 1 .5. In 2018, there will be a facilitated dialogue. 2020, we have to revise uh, and resubmit our INDC in light of the new information. Now, that is where the problem will be, that when that new information comes, it will show very clearly there is a very small budget. As I was explaining yesterday, the budget of over 1,000 gigatons will probably be down to 550 gigatons by then. And there is no mention on how that budget will be shared. So that is really where the real pitfall for the future lies. Now you can argue that the Indian government has managed to at least get in the fact that the agreement will be based on equity. So you can argue that tomorrow to say, as you said, it will be based on equity. We expect it to be an equitable reallocation of carbon space. But it's not there in the current agreement. Two other things, as far as loss and damage is concerned, the Americans have clearly won. Liability and compensation is out, which means that it is toothless. Okay? Um, the more worrying part of it is a trading mechanism has been set up now. But what is worrying me on the trading mechanism is, see, when we had CDM in the past, we did not have any mitigation obligations. Okay? So we could say that you invest in our part of the world, we will reduce emissions from that money, and you take the credit in your INDC. Now, I also have an INDC. My commitment will also have to be enhanced in the future, but I will also be selling you my cheap options. So what I'm doing now is not only saving, not only cutting emissions for myself, I'm also cutting emissions for you. And that is worrying me tremendously because CDM without a legal commitment to reduce emissions was a, a, a mechanism in which we could have always argue that it is cheaper in our part of the world to cut emissions so they can take credit for it. But now we have commitments, we have legal commitments to reduce emissions. Those will have to be enhanced every five years. And yet we are saying we'll also trade with you and give you our cheapest options. So that worries me. It's also a question of how countries will operationalize it. You can India can say Ham nahi karenge, but many other countries, smaller countries will. Because the last point is the money is still illusionary. Hundred billion dollars was meant is mentioned in the draft decision, decision but it has been removed.
from the agreement. It was there in the agreement till the last yes, draft. Sir. It has been removed in the agreement now. So it is no longer in the agreement. And um, we always know finance is very illusionary. So I think red, red plus and CDM will be the way for countries to get money for this action. And so what you're doing is to move the burden of transition on us. So my overall is a mixed comment. I will not bag it or trash the Indian government. I will simply say that we have managed to get something in. We've managed to get at least the issue of carbon, of, of the fact that the agreement will be implemented on the principle of equity in. But we have still not been able to operationalize equity. And that is my worry.